Hi, so in this video I'll be showing you how to convert a gas dryer to propane. So I'm going to be converting this gas dryer that's in this stackable washer and dryer to propane from natural gas, which is set to right now. So this kit has a few different pieces that need to be replaced in the dryer to allow the dryer to work with propane instead of natural gas. So this is a Whirlpool dryer and on this one it's necessary to remove this entire back panel on the dryer to get to the gas area which is down here and you remove all the bolts on the back of this panel so after you remove all the screws then you can remove the back panel right here so next I'll need to remove this cover right here so I can get to the gas assembly which is actually inside here Okay, so after that front panel is removed, it's much easier to access the gas assembly underneath here. This is the igniter and where the flame comes out. And the um, part I need to replace is all the way in the back here. So I'm going to remove this section. First, unscrew the gas inlet hose right here and then remove these connectors. That way this whole piece can come out. So now that I unscrewed the gas hose and removed the connectors, you can take out these screws right here, which I've already loosened, and one in the back. Now this entire piece can come out right here. So this is the piece I removed from the dryer. This is where the gas comes in, and then there's the regulator here. Underneath here is where the gas comes out, and we'll be changing that piece as well as this regulator right here. First, I need to remove a bolt right here. So the conversion kit includes two pieces, which is a new gas nozzle right here, as well as the regulator piece. So now I'm going to remove this gas nozzle right here. Just unscrews from this section. And this is the old gas nozzle. And I'll be replacing it with this new one, which is for propane. So the new one gets screwed into this hole right here. And screw it down really tightly. So next I'm going to replace this regulator right here. So this gets unscrewed with a flathead screwdriver. So this piece is the old regulator. And the new one has this long stem on it which goes down inside this hole right here. And now the dryer has been converted to propane, except it needs to be reassembled now. So the burner piece right here goes back in front of the gas outlet. And this bolt goes back in place. Next, this piece gets positioned back up inside here and reconnect the gas line and these connectors to the same places they came out of. After everything's been reinstalled, then you can close the dryer back up. Now that the dryer has been put back together, it's ready to use with propane.